Hi, welcome everyone to the game Storm Age and with the channel Kulu Kulu Dancing Doctor, whatever you call it, Clash of and now it's Dancing Doctor. Okay, uh, I want to show you today again um, Hero's Guide. Hero's Guide, I will show you first my, my guide, but I changed it already, my, uh, my build, sorry, my formation. But whatever, now we are starting uh, again with some guides. Uh, I made it a new formation, now I am uh, fighting with Gunner and uh, Templar. Templar and Dragonclyde and Tiger and Scuba is now in on my build, these all three or four, five hero. It will change, of course, if I get my Dragon Death Knight a little bit stronger, he is not really strong. But now I want to show you these heroes. We can start with Templar, I will show you really already, yeah. Dragon Knight is very useful if you get a purple Dragon Knight, because then you can... Mm, yeah, I will show you first the states. He is a mostly non-crit, he can crit. He's not, not a crit uh, damage hero, how you see, he have no uh, zero crit. That way, uh, he can, if he will do crit, uh, he can do, he can't can do with his own state, maybe with special item, item but not uh, with uh, normal uh, states. That's the first point that we have to know, but he have a nice dodge. 16 person is not really perfect, yeah, if you ask me, but yeah. And uh, he have a high defense um, and he have nice skills. The first skills is a skill that uh, you can um, breed of flame. If you start this skill, you will uh, get the countdown of dragon tile in on my uh, level 2 in 80 seconds lower but if you are upgrade for example then it's eight, uh, 1 second um, 1.20 second yeah that's not really a, dam a damage skill that you know it's just that the skill that it started uh, better for combination for example that uh, you get the dragon tile dragon tile uh, quantum uh, a little bit lower and and Dragon Tile is a skill that uh, launches two strikes, deal damage, and inflicts stone in one level one, two second. I didn't level this because for me two second is not really different than two and a half second or three second in this game. If you ask me, that's my thing. I think about that. That way, it's enough. It's two second, and because some the stuns you need your stuns mostly only for break the other character skills, other enemy hero skill. That way, I have my break. Two, uh, two seconds is enough. Um, better I get this skill. Sorry, this or this. Dragon Lang Age is a passive skill. Increase self damage reduction by 256 and restore your hit point and 108 on level 6 on my level. But I like this skill more than more because it's a very useful skill. It's an ultimate skill from Dragon Clyde. It's very good. It makes Dragon Clyde really really very strong if you think about this because the dragon knight on level 6 will be 7.50 seconds after casting the main skill main skill is the breath of flame if he casting breath of flame then he will 7.50 seconds he will um, reduce the damage that he get in 40 percent at level 6 and he can uh, his attack with ignoration armor and spell resistance of enemy and 50 but that means he will do 50 percent more damage is that not crazy for a tank hero that way of course i level this skill more i will get this on max level i think on level uh, 60 you can do in level 13 max i'm not sure but uh, i'm not sure i think level max level is level 15 i'm not sure really that means for me, I will get over 100% more damage on during this, and I will get to the over 12 second uh, duration. That means I can this permanently uh, this bonus. I can get this bonus. That way, Dragon Knight is in my formation. It's very important because he will get all. If you think about 60% uh, damage reduction, I think, and 60% person damage reduction is very crazy very crazy during 12 seconds or something like this or yeah yeah, yeah. no uh, yeah 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 during 12 seconds and that's very useful that way dragon Knight is 
for me one of the perfect character that passed, uh, passed uh, that uh, get in my combination really very useful so gunner i get this hero really new but i get this quick to the purple hero because he have a purple really very good um, very good um, uh, skill but before i begin with skills i will show you the uh, state the normal state uh, gun is a high damage class with a low defense and low hit points but he is not on first line that way it's no problem that he have a low damage and low hit points that's mean we have 8500 damage that's very crazy and he is really a crit damager he have 21.6% uh, uh, crit, uh, rate, crit rate and 66.8% crit multiplier. That means he will do 66.8% more damage. That's very good. Permanently if he do crit. Okay, that's coming to the point. He can do really nice dodging, but he have 9.5%. Um, it's not bad. It's not bad. That's the normal state. He have five range. is very useful. I get him to the AA, a better uh, grade. And mystery, I have at the moment uh, mastery um, level 14. I think it's better. I will get to, of course more. So let's begin with the skill. The first skill that the most with this skill you can do really big damage because I will show you after. It's a normal at the beginning. It's a just a normal range skill attack. Okay, but I get with this skill over 20k damage, whatever. And this one is AOA physical attack, launch three strike, start strike, and deals damage. I didn't level this because I believe this skill is not at the moment, but uh, it don't do really big damage. That way, I didn't uh, level this first. Maybe after, but I'm not sure. Range single physical attack deals. That way, uh, it's a ranged and single physical attack that's done only one uh, one uh, target. That's not really useful for me. That way, I didn't level this, and there is no time time increase for stun. That don't say if you level, you will stun in more than two or three seconds. That way, I didn't know. Normally, I level this and this mostly. Maybe one, maybe maybe I'm not sure. At, to the next, feel like this one, speed shot. So let's go to the ultimate skill is the more one of most important skill on this character because if the enemy have lower than 50% hit points your crit rate will be to the on my level 6 to the 11% and you have passively increased your attack on almost 1k attack it don't show here normally i have no 9500 attack in in, in fight uh, maybe more i will show you why but with this skill is normally you can see this here directly. It's don't show here. Normally it have to be 9,500, but it don't showing here. That's why it's no problem. But um, yeah, that's the gunner. And uh, let's uh, show you the tiger. Tiger is the best combination with gunner for me. I think I don't know really. I think because the tiger is uh, a same really really very crazy crit class with 25 1% crit and 82% crit multiplier that's a very good class for damage doing yeah that's very good damage but he she don't have a really high attack and then like a gunner but it's okay because she have more crit multiplier 20% more damage that's mean it's almost same attack with gunner whatever why I use the crit uh, build uh, with uh, tiger and gunner combination? It's here. That's a normal, normal attack skill with. Uh, uh, it's not high damage. It's not important. But this is just level one. This for me, because it's not the best thing that I can get. And now see this ranged single lunar arrow, lunar arrow, is uh, physical attack deals uh, damage and inflict stun if you get upgrade then we will get more stun but it's a single reduce earth armor of targets uh, yeah, i would say i don't level this it's not really uh, 
really a big different uh, it's one because it's single target and it's not really important that way it's a random that way i don't level this number two manor skill and let's go to the lab lab is a very useful skill that i said you per periodically increase the attack of all friendly heroes on the screen on 756 and attack speed on 52. i was checking youtube what is per periodically it say uh, it have to be normally always but i i don't see the effect on my other character that they gave get 50 percent more attack speed i don't know why can you, maybe you can write on the comment why it's i can't understand this skill it's passive let's say period, periodically increased attack and attack speed on the screen for early zero yeah but i i can be sure can be sure my my character uh, don't uh, do really, they don't have a more attack speed than normal 50 percent more attack speed i can understand this skill i will be happy if you can explain me a little bit not every time I am the people that who explain, sometimes I need to be explained from the other player. That way, whatever, it's a nice skill if I, uh, if it's uh, like I understand, I, I understand this skill so. Your allies get to uh, 756 uh, damage and 52% attack speed. And if it's so, it's very useful. If not, I don't understand this skill. Whatever, dark, dark side press can. That's the second skill that I don't understand really on this character. Increase the evasion of alias by nine, uh, by ten percent. Okay, but in this game there is no evasion. There is dodge. I don't see any evasion. Where? There is no state that that name evasion, evasion or what you call. But dodge is here. Dodge is here. I can't understand. I was think it was Deutsch. I was I hoped it's so, but I don't think it's so. If it's so, it's very useful. These two skills are very useful, but I will be happy if someone can explain me what's really meaning for these two skills. What does really these two skills mean? I will be happy if someone can explain me. That was the tiger and scuba. Yeah, um, I will say that's enough for this record. I will try to do every day so I will show you more and more heroes and more hero skill. But it's enough for today. Have a great day, have a good game, and ciao from here. The game Storm, Storm Age.